Hello everyone and welcome back to Corona's Place Trails in the Sky second chapter today. Well, we are gonna go south. And why is that Kronos? Because I want to go to the Ambril Tower and de defeat the monster there. There's also, oh wow, oh yeah, that's right. You got the Orbital Shop down here and the Arm Shop. I was here last time. We already, yeah, we already checked all that. Uh, yeah, I want to defeat the, the monster there and I want to explore the tower. Why? Because I have no idea how to solve that Blue's, Cru Blues Riddle and I'd rather not waste too much of my time trying to do that today. So let's go ahead and just go down to the Emerald Tower and finish all that. You find a skeleton wearing the name tag reading MT Chester. Sorry, that was a lie, you find nothing. MT Chester, why does that sound familiar? Uh, it's not a Goonies reference, that was Cobblepot. Any birds around here? I see that item though. Thank you for the softening bomb. Pro tip, you can hide the body in <laughs> You can hide the body in the empty chest. Uh, I won't tell anyone what you did. Thanks? Very, uh, well, incriminating of you, bird. Uh, it barely looks like a bird, but it is a bird. So, I need Estelle. I guess it's you soul blur on this dude, because he's not weak to anything. You nodded off. We're gonna kill this poor bastard in his sleep. I mean, we did just wait. No, he's still asleep. Good. Goodbye, then. Please drop your eggs. I need four more eggs. You gave me an earthworm. It's almost the same as your eggs, to tell you the truth. No, it's not, though. Not at all. Thank you for the terror bomb. You get away with, uh, you get away with running your hands this random chest once. Oh, down this random chest once. Don't push your luck. You liked it, chest probably. I need more birds. Yeah, I could check my bestiary to see if those bird dudes actually drop the uh, the eggs. That being said, I think I'm just gonna go ahead and attack and make pretend that uh, I'm like I know what we're doing. Now, I did actually change a bit of, uh, you dick, of my recording setup, aka my computer setup. Uh, I decided to go ahead and hook my computer up to my 50 inch television, and it looks fantastic. However, I'm not sure if there's gonna be any recording issues. I don't think they will be. Like, everything looks crisp and, well, just, quite frankly beautiful um hopefully it still is it looks like it's recording just fine now it's not gonna be like a 40k video that's a little little much i think um for this type of video so it will still be like 1980 or 10 1080p yeah 1920 1080p i know what i'm talking about clearly but man, everything seems so much clearer, like, and I can see the text. My computer monitor is, while usable, quite old and quite small. It's like 24 inches. I had two of them, which is good. Where do I get my bestiary? Seriously, where's my bestiary? Oh, there it is. No, yeah, there it is. Uh, not Zeiss. We want... Where the hell is Bose? We want Woodpecker? Uh, Elder Owl. You do not drop... No, wait, that's not it. It's a boss. You're a Woodpecker. You do drop bird eggs. Okay, you're level 62? Congratulations, man. West Ambril Tower. Let's go sell first. Why? Well, why not? There'll be treasure down there. I will admit, though, the controller feels weird. I don't know why. Oh, this, there's definitely going to be a fishing spot here, huh? Yeah. You trying to teach your husband how to fish? F fish. Fish. Fish, Kronos. God damn it. Oh. <laughs> uh... Yeah. 
Let's go f fishing, shall we? At least once, catch something, and then, uh... Probably don't even need to use this, right? Probably could have used, like, something a little bit, uh... I don't know, more fishingly. What does that even mean, Kronos? I don't know anymore. What do you mean, get away? Got it. I got a ooh, catfish, huh? Emergency puppet. Kinky. Uh, all right. I guess we can go inside and check out some of the people here. I could have recipes to learn. Is this where we? Yeah, we. This is where we staked out the uh, the sky band. No. Yes. No. Yes, it was. They met with Lawrence, and we followed them home. By home. I mean to their base. Where's the door? Oh god damn it, the door's down there, but the door's up here too. Nada. Definitely nothing in there. That leads outside again. Okay. Can I take one of these fishing rods? No? That's disappointing. Uh do you no, that's just rest. I should probably talk to you though, right? Nope, alright. You don't remember me. Hi. Shop. So we need both of these. The first one doesn't restore that much. Like, at all. Uh, talk. Do you remember me? I mean, maybe. You're just not saying anything about me. So I gotta admit, it's hurtful. It's... Making me sad. Didn't we help you? I thought we helped you. I fished here. I know that much. All right, let's head to the Emerald Tower. Get the hell out of that way. Hmm. Maybe it's the TV. Doesn't look like it's happening on the recording. The refresh rate on the TV should be as good as the monitor was. What do you mean? What are you talking about, Kronos? Uh, there's some like little lag spikes. When walking around. All right, I think that does it. So. Pro tip, if you're gonna do what I'm doing and using your your gigantic TV as a second monitor, uh, make sure you go to display settings and it's not selected for 30 uh, refresh rate. Because when you're playing a 60 frames per second game and the monitor is stuck at 30, it makes it so that you wanna puke uh, and it makes it all a little jaggy. So yeah, everything's a lot better now though, thank God. I would, be, I would be pretty upset, actually, that, uh, that it was stuck at 30. I went and checked that, because I'm like, this this doesn't make any sense. This mon this TV is, I got it to be, like, good. <laughs> like, as, as good as it can be. I know you can get, like, 120 uh, refresh rate on, like, monitors and TVs. I don't know about TVs, but, like, monitors these days. But, you know. When I got this TV a few years back, I was like, yeah, that's, that should be good enough. And for the most part, it is for me, uh, but to each their own. So I was just kind of really surprised that it was so jagged when we first started the episode. And I didn't really notice until we got to, like, on the field. But thankfully, that's no longer the case. Um, let's do Diamond Dust. You know what? We'll put this here. I guess we'll just attack this one back here. Good job. Oh, they're all in? I think they're all in. They're all dead. Piece of cake indeed. Uh, cannon Impulse 2. That's a lot of Earth Scepter. Wow. So we want that bad Larry up there. 
Guess we gotta go this way. Is that the... Is that really the only way? I mean, we can go up from there. Oh, we can go this way. This should have... Uh, this looks like it led around. Uh, good amount of stuff is not that much, actually, all around. Am I maxed out on something? That should not be the case. I'm close to a thousand for Earth. I don't think it caps at 999, though. I could be wrong. Hashtag. Alright, just standard. Same counter we did last time. Uh, Alright, actually, I didn't also shut off the game and... Go into the th configs because it's kind of weird, but my uh, my shoulder buttons here they got they got revamped to not give me free camera control. It's like it was 45 degrees, and I don't know why I did that. That's really weird. That's a new healing item. I think that's the, the stronger healing item. HP four. You find a skeleton wearing a name pack? We already saw that one. Thanks. This is gonna be to a treasure. You guys again? I kinda wish there was more bird enemies here. I mean, apparently we didn't get this chest. That's trails in the chest. It looks boring. You put the paper down. Ah, <laughs> uh, self deprecating humor a little bit. Let's grab this chest. Topaz talisman, thanks. You obtain nothing! Absolutely nothing! Don't gotta yell at me, dog. Damn. So we have multiple ways to go up now. I'm gonna go this way because it's the closest one. And there was a red chest next to it, so maybe there's more red chests up here, but probably not. Uh, let's see. That goes up. That might be the way to the top. Wait a minute. There's supposed to be a monster somewhere around here, right? Did I miss that on the outside? I might... Um, you are... New. You fought enemies like you, I think, before in the past, but... You're weak to fire, huh? Good job. That's a... Decent amount of damage. To, uh, say the least. You're weak to fire. But you're alright with wind. Uh, we can get two here, so let's do two there. Oh, wow. Oh, thank we get all three now. I guess I should have went for the one in the back, huh? Oh, God. Stop doing that. Tita, just, you can wait. Or you can move. They are, uh, they did, they did, they take next to no physical damage. I mean, fair enough, right? They are slimes, flans, kind of not like flans, but they are slimes. They can be pretty resistant against physical. I like how a got takes as much damage as a Tita. Uh, Draguna Edge 2, okay. Draguna? Not dragon, that's for sure. Uh, Oliver, sure, you can do this. There you go, dog. Is this just going in a circle? No, it it didn't go in a circle. Huh. Okay, so I guess both stairs led to this area. Proxy Puppet, great. Let's take all the typos we accidentally left in this game at launch and shove them all in here. Pretend they never happened. You know, dog, I actually kind of believe you wanted to do that because there have been actually a lot of typos in this game. At least I'm, I'm noticing them a lot more than I did the first game, if that's the case. The weak to wind. And Tita's cannon. Well, no, not really. I'm gonna assume they're stationary. I oh, shouldn't assume that, but I'm gonna. I think we'll go ahead with a final break.
here? The jelly dudes in the back aren't gonna take damage. Oliver, you can go ahead and use another aerial here. A got might be exploded <laughs> in a sec. Yep. Oh, ow. Okay. That was some fancy damaging. Not really, but it was fancy, kind of. Stop hitting him. You killed him. You monsters. Tita, revive a god, please. And Oliver, I think... Here should be fine. Should kill both of them, I think. Not even close. I'm surprised. Okay, we do go before that one. Thank you for attacking her and not a god. Why not? We can use fire. Guess we should have used that. Enjoy the show. Our level ups, lovely. We get ebony shoes. You kick the chest open, but all you get for your talented footwork is some stub toes. Ow. Uh, let's see what these boots do. I hear they're made for walking. They're not on the list, so male only? Yeah. Uh, they're gonna go to Oliver. Yeah. <laughs> yes, they are. All right, Oliver. I need you to heal the party again. I was about to ask how you actually had max EP, but you got to level up. And I didn't remember that for some reason. Long Barrel 3. Well, that's going to Tita, I think. I mean, Oliver could make use out of it if he was more geared out to be a... Oh, wait, no. It was Long Barrel 2, not 3. I get super excited. Can I equip two of those? Apparently I can. I'm not going to, though. The way up. Another chest. Star rabbits. You sneakily crack the lid of the chest and take a peek inside. Sadly, no treasure chest fairies flying around in there. No items either. And it's, uh, it's hard trying to find those uh, chest fairies, but... They, uh, they, they'll, they'll one day be ours. This is not bad. Ah, oh, I forgot to equip the shoes. It's a lot of agility. Sure. Oh, right, I didn't equip the armor yet. Sure, you can have that. And you have the ebony shoes. All right, cool, cool, cool. That's, look at, yeah, that was the fairy one. You touched me. Woo, Estelle leveled up. We're at the top. There's the monster. All right, we probably need to heal a little bit. They'd like to attack a, a god, which is fine by me. Let's go. Exterminate. All right, you guys are horrifying looking. Good lord. Steals life and splits when injured. It's acting a bit odd. Octobone. Okay. Oh, that was your special. Okay. I like the way you think. Probably could have afforded you. You're right. That's not that scary. Don't don't be a baby. So can we hit him with an aerial? You can't. You moved. I guess that makes sense, right? Well, if that's the case, I'll put this right here. Um. Sure. Didn't move. You moved! Stop confusing yourself! You're making me waste EP. 
Okay, so something's definitely going on. The last monsters we had, they were scared of us. These ones, they're really not here either. They're acting odd, as they said. So yeah, something's definitely going on. I don't get confused. Anymore. They're horrifying looking. Space Jam? Re really? Should we shut up and jam? Or shut up and slam? Whatever the hell it's called? Oh yeah, just get up there and slice him. Good job. Good job, Tita. We killed pretty much helpless monsters that had no idea that we were here to kill them. Sadly, they didn't drop any bird eggs. Alrighty then. Looks like we're done with these guys. Now, we have... This monster left. Specializes in the cold attacks. Be sure to check gear in advance. I'm sure there's going to be another gimmick with them where they're not acting quite right. Ghost Epitaph. Okay. Uh, we need bird eggs. We have everything else. We need four more bird eggs. And then we need to figure this out. Um, the end of everything is the beginning. Recule. The end of everything back in the, in the flower. If I don't figure this out by next episode, I might look it up. Because I actually have no goddamn idea what this is referring to. The end of everything is the beginning. Okay. So... What? Back... Back the in flower. Back the in flower. Back the in flower. It's flower in the back. Okay, flower in the back. We're cool. So if we're, we're gonna go with that one, flower in the back, it would be Luke, Luke Sir, the Sir, the Sir. It would probably be spelled L-U-C-I-R then, right? I don't know what the hell that is though. <laughs> um, it's something in the town. That's what Estelle was saying. Okay, so this is what's gonna happen. I'm gonna farm up some bird eggs. Get four of those. And then I guess I'll look around town for Luke, Luke Ur, and Luke Sir, Luke Sir. I don't know. I don't know how to pronounce that. Um, and see if I can find it. And apparently wherever that is, or whatever that, whatever that is, it's gonna be, there's gonna be a flower in the back that we have to find out. But that will be next time. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, press like below. If you're not subscribed yet, want to hear my videos, I can check out some of the content, see if it's to your liking. If you're watching me live stream, head to twitch.tv slash Give my channel a follow to be notified when I go live. Either way, thanks for watching. Hope you all have a great day.